Welcome back to my Let's Play SSX Tricky for the GBA. That version that nobody ever thinks about. So, yeah, it sounds like Eddie just ranked up silently without anyone ever actually knowing, because he's a rank net. He's a rookie rank, specifically, not just any rank. He's a rank. He is... Presumably also in increased in stats. Along with that, I haven't checked. So I seem to have deciphered the secret to races in this game. Oh, thank you. More. Okay, we actually have jumps that are closer together. I was starved of actual opportunities to do tricks in that first one. Garibaldi. Yeah, this actually feels to some degree like Snow Dream. I like it. Ah, don't hit your head on that thing, please. Oh yeah, I'm liking this. Not my fault. It's okay, someone's gonna catch up to me because I fell, specifically. Now will be my opportunity to take revenge. On who or what specifically, I'm not entirely sure yet, but it will happen. But come on, Eddie, you are just fine. Also, there, like how everyone is like a really, oh, all over there. I like how everyone's always in like a really easy identify pack in this game. There's, there's no like clear leader or anything like that. You're just ahead of everyone or not. Also, that came out of nowhere. Thanks to you. These people are basically ammunition for my boost. And finish up with a nice Uber. Awesome. Nice thing to Uber. Why would I, why, was that just like points or what? Oh, no it wasn't. Awesome, it's actually like a normal trick boost. It's nice. I have no use for that though, so let's just hold the boost button until we're done. Which you guys won't be able to notice at all because there's no visual or audio, no visual or audible indication whatsoever that I'm using boost. But it's happening, I assure you. Take my word for it. Yeah, so I have a feeling that now that I've figured out a formula for racing in this game, unless something Interesting it's thrown at me in any of these uh, tracks, which may or may not happen. I'm gonna have some smooth sailing from here on out. Look at that. We'll have to see. Let's keep going. Why is it all the same people? Like that there's there's not a progression from one to another if it's all the same people. So one thing I should probably check, well, it, oh, whoa, oh, I was accidentally trying to push so on when I was in the air, so I grabbed at the last second. Let's jump over that. I did not do that. Okay, cool. So, since it said that Eddie specifically is a rookie at this point, since he ranked up and nobody else did, I'm guessing that just like in the console version, you uh, increase the stats and rank of all the characters separately. So that means that if I want to try out any new characters, I'd probably have to try out those characters with really terrible stats, which would not be desirable. Darn it. I didn't really complete a 180 there, but okay. There we go. Whoa, okay. Determining whether or not you collide with something is pretty tough. Okay, that one jump fakes me out. I don't like that jump. There we go. Excellent. And our jumps. That was very excellent. excellent. No, it wasn't. Don't mock me. Tricky. 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 Did I punch her out of the sky? That's awesome. Whoa, what happened there? Alright. Phasing through solid matters. Also, pretty good skill, I guess. No, Eddie, no, stop. 
Oh, she could like cancel out of a trick or something. I don't want to commit to that. I realize that things are going south very quickly. I'm definitely doing better spins now. My stats have certainly increased. What? How did I... When did I pick that up? I don't think that I... was anywhere near that. Oh. Okay. That's cool, too. I was, I was trying to do an actual grab. I guess it doesn't matter what rank I get on this particular race, anyways. So I can just keep ahead here. See if I can actually catch up to Sia. Not Sia, that's Marisol. Sia, Sia and Marisol are two characters I just never pay much attention to in this game, so I tend to think of them similarly. In the sense that I don't think of them, so they kind of occupy like the same place in my mind as that character I don't think about. So I confuse their names sometimes. So I'm getting the impression that although a viable option is to boost your way through the entire through the entire race, you can also just never do any tricks at all and also do at least as well. So as I would like to try out some other characters, not that it would really change anything, you just get to see the sprites. It seems like that's not going to happen, specifically because I'd have to play as them with their terrible starting stats. And that would not be desirable, that would really throw me off actually. <laughs> Bye, Simon. I can't tell if other enemy or other characters try to knock you down or not. Because there was one point where I knocked down Simon, I actually fell down at the same time. But I didn't see Simon try to do anything to me. Crap. See, I knew I wasn't gonna make that jump, so I didn't actually try to do an Uber trick. But I also decided to do another trick that wasn't an Uber trick. I was I wanted to hit him. And ended up falling anyways. Come on. Just catch up to the dude. Ah. JP, you are my means, does it? I'm getting through with this. I pick that up. I need there we go. That's what I need. Yeah, just a little bit more. A little indeed, in fact. Oh, come on, Eddie! You were... Uh, I'm playing that trick just fine. Oh, that trick boost didn't really seem to apply that time. Like, I didn't rotate particularly quickly. By any measure of mine. Rotation speed in this game is comp comparable to that of the original SSX, and that is incredibly slow. Also, if you guys could, could please stop being ahead of me. Preferably getting me boosted in the process. There we go. Oh, great. Crap! Oh, I'm gonna be stuck in these things too now. Okay, no, no, I'm not, but still very concerned. Without actually getting gold now. Oh, I need to knock down Kiori. That was a nice hop. But we're at the very end of the track. Ah, oh, come on! Crap. And the one time I don't get first. No, I refuse. That was the second best time, too. That wasn't actually a particularly bad time at all. Do I have to restart all of these? I'm not sure if I do or not. Come on, here we go. There we go, see I had a nice start to the like last time. Okay. So I think that is good.
Man, a machine. Killing machine, <laughs> if nothing else. Why did I? Oh, whoa! That I did not expect to land that. I didn't get air. Okay, I had intended to. Can I pull it off? Yeah, I actually managed to pull off that jump. I realized just a moment too late that that was the jump it was. Come on! That wasn't too bad. Didn't give me much of anything with regard to boost, but it's something. Yeah. There you go. Alright. Anyways, what happened last time I think was mostly just the well, well, aside from messing up some tricks, I kept hitting those uh, obstacles. Ah, damn! I thought I actually got a jump on that one at that time, too. There we go. I didn't jump! Why am I not- Ah! Actually getting air is my biggest obstacle here. That's what's happening. I'm not getting air for some reason. Okay, now I'm good. I just need to not hit walls. And not jump unnecessarily like that. Come on, dude. Oh. See, and I'm pretty okay. It seems like if you hit a wall in midair, you slow down, which is kind of annoying. Because you're basically getting slowed down by hitting nothing. Man, I made a... I pulled ahead pretty late there. Luther, that's grand. Well, the part of it is that the uh, characters that I'm... Oh, that's good. The rate AI actually gets a lot faster in the uh, later parts. Seems like. Alright, so let's see if we can actually do a nice show-off run. <laughs> yeah, so it's not really a loading screen anymore, it's just a description screen. <laughs> Now the console version, that tire screen is actually used to load things, but... Oh. That works too. Kinda jumped over that thing right there. Without really meaning to. Alright. So... That was really way in over my head. So it seems like it's mostly the trick mu multipliers, and yeah, uh, as well as the uh, dude. And it's mostly just hitting everything, like hitting everything you can. Uh, it's mostly not like wiping out and missing opportunities to do tricks. That's what everything is in this. With regards to as many points as you want to. You note to self: you cannot boost on rails. I loved boosting on rails in the console version. You always had so much speed. Not gonna do it over there because I know it's not gonna end well. Aw oh, man. Oh! Yeah! Pulling something off. Crap, that actually really hurt me not getting that five times multiplier. Oh, being five uber tricks in one. Like, that's good. It's a thing that you want to have happen. That's how I not get that. Alright, whatever. Unsure if I'll get to the next jump with Tricky Intact. Did it! Okay, so that's a lot of uber tricks at once. And. That will bring me pretty close. That was actually something of a combo. That was cool. Alright, and let's just get to the finish. Like, no need to make things overly grandiose. Come on! What's this this guy not completing rotations like that? 
Yeah, you know, if we get a goal, let's just get to the end and be done with it instead of risking running out of time. We're not here to set any world records or anything. Oh, why did I not hit that? Yeah, like I said, let's actually just get ahead and go. Nice snowflakes. Like, you're here, and I appreciate that. And I wouldn't mind collecting you, but I don't need to. Okay, yeah, apparently I got... Apparently I did way better than I really need to. I can't just see random characters' names <laughs> next to the track. Apparently I did a lot better than I needed to. With regards to getting points, because... I am... There's so much of this track left, and so many more opportunities for points. Okay, cool. There you go. So that will be it for this episode of Split SSX Tricky for the GBA. I went well. Two gold medals. And nowhere near the top score, well, because I wasn't trying. Well, that's not the only reason, but that's part of it. Lots of 180s! I actually... do they not... Oh well, I guess that's the number of 180s in general, so I guess if we do a 360 that counts as 280s. So, I did less rotation. But I'll see you guys next time in this episode of Let's Play SSX Tricky, where we... Are the stats actually better? No, they're not. Are the characters that actually have like 20 in any given stat? Oh, hey, it's Marty! Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure I'm running a... Oh, well, yeah. That's why I have the language select. I'm running a European version of this game, so we have Marty instead of Mac, for those of you familiar with Mac. He's... I don't know why they have two different characters for NTSC and PAL, but Marty's the European dude that replaces Mac. They're cousins. But, uh... Oh! Do they actually have, like, better stats overall? It looks like they do. They do! What? Okay, so that little plot twist in mind. Well, uh, I guess we'll, maybe we'll try out JP next episode. We'll see. Uh, see you guys.